German director and producer Monica Treut has been making fiction and documentary films for over 30 years. As a lesbian women rebel filmmaker, I've always been an outsider. And an outsider, I believe, is capable to learn the rules quite fast. With over 200 films and many awards, including Best Feature Film and Documentary Film at the Torino International Gay and Lesbian Film Festival, 62-year-old Toit has received this year's Teddy Award, which honors queer cinema for lifetime achievement at the Berlin Film Festival. You know, I didn't go for a career in, in directing or so, and it just uh, developed organically as, you know, I was living my life. I was asked one day to write a script for a feature film by Elfi Mikesh and we worked together on the script and that later became the movie Seduction, The Cruel Woman. And then we became lovers in the course of the uh, process of writing the script and then we co-directed it and co-produced it and we started a, a a production company as well. The movie was banned in Germany at one point, and it was thought to be too dangerous for young people due to its display of sadomasochistic practices. Um, there is no total nudity, there is no sexual intercourse, it's more in your head. That was considered more dangerous than probably, you know, showing flesh. I am Susie Sexpert, and these are some of my friends. This is Gina Bonbon bon and Candy Samples. It's very important to show women who are not, like, fitting in. I think we have to accept women. I, I mean, I love women like that, who are eccentric and, like, you know, boom. Let other people be upset, but, you know, let these women speak out. When I think back, I've got so many no's from funding bodies uh, for my films. And pretty much each no I got made me more persistent and more determined to make this film. so many people against this subject or against this person or against the script hmm there must be something really subversive in there so let's do it Toit will be honored at a gala ceremony in Berlin on February the 17th never take no for an answer well that's all from us this week don't forget to check out our daily news bulletins throughout the week and check back with us again next week for more Pink 60 Entertainment